Hey everyone, it's Calvin, also known as Romer, and this is my first ever playthrough of Super Mario Odyssey, and Bowser is in a very nice tux suit. It's interesting to start directly with a Bowser fight, right? Usually Bowser swoops in afterwards, like, to make a little bit of a problem. That is beautiful, I've never... I have never seen these characters look prettier than this. What the hell? This is the end. For you! Oh, we're doing voice acting. Interesting. His hat. His hat? Oh, he lost his hat. Now, of course, there's some stuff I definitely have seen from this game, I've heard from this game. I saw the trailers coming up to the game. You just squashed the hat, okay. Time for my withing with Peach. You don't want it, bro. Jealous Mario. Bro, come on. You don't want it. <laughs> bro, you need to find, you find a girl that likes you. You really do. Really cool looking ship as well. The hat got destroyed. Now, we do know, like, from watching the trailers, like, we're gonna have, like, a magical hat. Look at the fabric on the hat. Oh, this is how it happens? I'm actually super excited to play this, and I have chills thinking about this. It's actually a coincidence, by the way, that the Mario movie is coming out this week, and I'm playing this. Like, if I was a smarter person, it wouldn't be a coincidence. It is a coincidence. It's such an interesting way. Oh, look around. Oh. Okay. Jump. Is that still a... Okay, so we have run around, jump. Oh, man. It's funny, because when Mario Odyssey got announced, I had not really played a Mario platformer on the channel in full. Uh, I played Mario Bros. U. They, we can do. I'm trying some tricks from the other games. Sorry, they kind of work. There's no spin jump. Look at this city, though. What is this like with the fog and stuff? Like a nightmare before. Oh, like top hats on the hat town and on the buildings actually. But yeah, I didn't really understand the gravitas and, like, the importance of Mario Odyssey when it was announced because I never really played the Mario platformers as much as other people did. People were going crazy, like, oh my god, you can do this, you can do that. I'm like, is that is that a big deal? And now playing this, it's like, instantly you feel like a difference. Instantly you feel like this upgrade. You feel like a progression is happening. Like, this is gorgeous. What are these frogs doing here? The frogs are top it. So they all have top So it's like a hat city. Oh, who are you? I'm Mario. You're not the one of them, are you? No, I'm not, sorry. I mean, yeah, probably good for you, though. He has a piece of the torn hat as well, like, he grabbed this as soon as possible. Which means it's probably of some importance to him. I'm so sorry for running away like that. Uh, you startled me, and I do startle easily. I saw what happened earlier. Uh, you've been through quite the ringer. You've landed in the Cap Kingdom. We've been under attack for the same monster that gave you to- Sorry, my new shoes just arrived. Uh... You've landed in the Cap Kingdom. We've been under attack by the same monster that gave you such a trouncing. And to make matters worse, uh, the fiend has kidnapped my little sister. Oh, she's kidnapped my future wife. That's bad, man. What is up with Bowser? To give her a crown? That's kind of disgusting, Bowser. I hope to give chase to the monster in a ship of my own. Unfortunately, all of our airships were wrecked in the attack. Although, now that I think on it, I'm fairly certain there's a functioning ship in the next kingdom over. I could get this there if only I could reach the guard the, with the tower which is being guarded by the monster. It's henchman. You know, it seems we're after the same thing. Perhaps we should team up. Let's see if we can help those two. Yeah, I agree. But I have no hat. Oh, that feels naked, right? Oh! Suits us. Suits us very well. Not your style? How about this? 
This is how it gets morphed together. Yeah, suits. That works. Oh, you, you okay? Mario just just like first instinct, throw you. <laughs> Cappy is now your companion. Okay, so I show you why. So I've seen, I saw in the trailers like like five years ago, literally like f no, like six years ago, that you can do this. Or maybe or maybe that comes later. You can like jump on the cap. So we can use it to destroy stuff as well. We can. I'm taking my time because this is the last really of the Mario platformers games I have to play. Some people say Mario 64, um, but maybe we will get around to it too. I'm on the tour. I do hope my darling boyfriend is alright. Your darling boyfriend is okay, I promise you. Oh, we can just do that, okay. Oh, look at the look at this on the wall as well. The little poster. So sick. The music is so good. The music is so good. Oh my god, the music is so good. Like, it doesn't need to be this good. <laughs> Calm down. My airship, my beautiful airship, ruined. Yeah, buddy. How do you think I feel? They stole me wife. <laughs> I suppose everyone has something of value to lose, don't they? Oh, you can do like wall jumps as well, which is going to be interesting, right? Nice. Take those coins. We have to collect. I think. I wonder if it's still a hundred coins to get like a life. Like if that's the method here. Some down below here. More movie posters. Or like, I guess posters advertising the wedding. Because I don't think Bowser would have people invited to the wedding. Right? But he would... Have, um... Like, people forcefully come or make it seem like it's a bigger deal, right? Because that's, like, that's him. That's Bowser, like... I'm just super happy to be back in any Mario world. Let alone, like, a very brand new one. When this game got announced, really, like, again, like I said, I didn't really, like, understand the gravitas, you know. I, I watched Kyle Bosman, who was one of my favorite streamers, go nuts, go absolutely nuts. And, like, I can totally understand it now, especially from, like, someone who's, like, played most of them now, or a lot of them now. Welcome to Bonneton, Pride of the Cap Kingdom. Do you know about the action guide? Uh, show me. Uh-oh. Controls, basic actions, capture actions. Um, look. <laughs> we'll learn about it as we go along, okay? Yeah, we can open, I and mean, we need to, we'll open it. I know it's probably like famous last words. People are going to be like, Calvin, you're going to regret that. That's fine. That's fine. If I do regret it, that's fine. Okay, if I regret it, I'll admit that I'll regret it. If you're new to this channel, there is a lot of admittance of being wrong. If we're wrong, we are wrong. We admit it. Okay? The water coming out here as well. And, like, what if it seems like the coins so far... Now, it could be something completely different. I don't even know. The coins so far are definitely much, like, a lot to do with, um... Are you in for the hat tour? The entrance is overhead. Uh, it seems like the coins are like, hey, explore, get some coins. See the world. Oh, we can make flowers. I'm not a big fan of flowers, but we'll make them. Oh, that's... Oh. Okay. I can see the monsters minions from here, but all I can do is play Tabasty and Rich. It's okay, dude. That's what I'm here for. That's why they hired a plumber. That's why they hired me. Yeah. I don't know. I think it's I think it's very smooth so far. There's also a compass. And there's boards. We set all the boards free. Now you go fly up there as well, please. What does this do? Yeah, this is really cool. Like, a really cool, interesting starting area, because, like, for my money, Mario games always usually start, Mario, they always usually start with, like, a very green land, right? Very green, like, area. Um, or in general, or they'll start, like, right at Peach's Castle. Um, Super Mario Sunshine started off in, like, the very colorful plaza, 
Super Mario Bros. U started off in the... Um, oh, look at this. Ooh. Started off in like a green acorn. It's like acorn something, isn't it? Then Super Mario Bros. Super Mario 64 start, first level is also like it's in Peach's Castle, but the first level is also a very green area as well. They kind of like to sell you in with kind of like very cutey kind of stuff. What the fuck? I seem to know you and not like you. Yeah, I, I, I know. I know. Oh, and they're coin. They have coins in them. <laughs> Where'd my brothers go? But yeah, like it's very, to me, it's just very interesting starting off in this place. In my opinion. Oh, the ghost coins. Fa There's gonna be phantom coins? So there could have been phantom coins all along. So I throwing me at the door. I know. I didn't know. I'm pretending I knew. I was probably just gonna try walk into it first. Try anyway. Top at. Freaking like vibes of this area. Calvin, don't use the word vibe. We hate the word vibe. Man, I'm just very upset that people um have ruined the word vibe. <laughs> Cause the word oh wow. The word vibe is fantastic and it fits like everything you can need. Can I throw this at you? Wait. What does this do? Wait, so this is just like we become the frug. Oh, we're like going into his like gene pool. Genetics are getting fused. Are you serious? <laughs> There's a picture of a frog. So this is the first animal we've gone into. We could could we've gone into a bird there? Or is that that's not possible? What does it look like? You captured a frog, so it's Pokemon style. So jump Oh my lord. And oh, we can dash as well. Hold on a second, watch this. And we can swim as well. Hold on a second. This is the way to go. But if you remember something. In the cutscene, we saw something up here instead as well, also. But how are we going to get to that, though? See, I think in future we have to learn to just turn around, don't we? Like, because that's what's teaching us right away. Is that you can turn around and get stuff. Freaking genius. What a genius game. I love this. How do we get rid of... How, I wonder... I'm pressing all the buttons. Do we get rid of this thing? Probably showed us. Hold on a second. We have the action guide. So we have... Let's just check. Let's just check. Capture actions. Uh, shake tie jump. Huh. So you can roll as well. Jesus Christ, man. We're going to have to learn a lot of new moves. Should I be playing with the Joy-Cons? Should I break out the Joy-Cons for this? What do you guys think? If you guys think I should play with Joy-Cons... Uh... Donate... 305 euro to me. Then I'll know. No, all your life savings. And I'll know. But how do I fight you guys? Can I jump on you? That's just not fair. I actually feel bad for you guys. That's actually, that's actually like, I actually think I, I cheated. I think I'm a cheater with your head. Like, I, don't get me wrong, I like being a frog. But I think it's just time for, time for me to stop cheating. You know what I mean? This is, this is like, I feel like I'm getting all the benefits of being a frog. And not having to worry about being Mario. This happens in the movie too. And we can swim also. I think Joy-Cons are probably the best way to play this game, I'll be honest with you. I have my Skyward Sword Joy-Cons, and I've been, I haven't used them since Skyward Sword, so like... It might be nice to break them out. You know what I mean? It might be nice to break them out. I wonder if we get damaged, do we like, stop being this frog? <laughs> I guess I'll never know. 
Oh, nice, a heart. Not that we need it, but I guess when we don't have a heart, we get a bunch of coins, so that's good. Z okay, ZL. ZL. Perfect. I wish I'd have known that a while ago. But hey, look. I, I pressed every button but ZL. That's how you know I'm a bad video game player. And that's how you know I'm a hopeless. I'm hopeless. Oh, we can swim? Okay, one second, boys. I'll be back in a second. I can't leave this behind. It's not happening. It's not happening. Now, okay, let's go back and get a frog. <laughs> no coins left behind. I'm telling you this. Ah, uh, there we go. I think we'll avoid these. Uh, I mean, like, there's no. I guess we can stop them. I mean, why not? I'm not in any rush to beat this game. Like, really, the only game planned we have after this is like an Undertale replay, and Breath of, and Tears of the Kingdom, I should say, is like the next game. So like, really, like, I'm not really like, looking to like, rush through this just to make this game like, any less. Wait, could we have jumped up here though, I wonder? Maybe. I guess we'll never know. Oh, we're here. And there's a little shortcut as well. I wonder, could we capture the ghosty goose? We can just jump over here as well, which is funny. Maybe we should hide somewhere. Maybe we should. I have my darling in the plaza. I hope she's alright. Your darling is dead. Your darling is gone. I'm so sorry. She got crushed. I say do be careful. The monsters longing and henchmen are still on top of the tower. Top of the tower. You've been living here all your life and you don't know what it's called? I know, I got it wrong. Nice. Here we go. Oh, we got a clap for that? Why? Oh, this is gonna be a boss? First boss? What are the bunnies? Look at the one, the tall one with the hat! <laughs> the bell's warm, well, there'll be a fellow with a mustache coming along. Guess we ought to introduce ourselves. We're the wedding planners for the happy couple. They call us the Brutos. Oh, Jesus. I love them. We got that treasure we needed, so we ain't got no more business in these parts. I come stuffing up a game with you two shoes, and others was in the contract, so I guess we still got a little work to do. Jesus Christ, look at this boy. I'm gonna kill you. You are over. Look at that right there. Can we do this? Oh my god, so that's simple. I'll take all these, thank you. Which one is he under? Magical hat style, Yu-Gi-Oh style. Hey, he's that one. Is that it? Brutal is more like the easies. Really beautiful scene here as well. Look at this. I, I'm using a pro controller, so I'm wondering, can I? So you can you can use motion control. That goes up. Okay. Yeah, you can use motion control. Okay, but I'm thinking Joy Cons might be better. You know what I mean? Joy-Cons might be a little better to use with this. We'll see though. We'll see how, like, I think the Joy-Cons will give us more of like a, a Mario Galaxy feel. Oh, wow. Give me a title screen.
And here's, I suppose, like what I was talking about. I said a big greenery land, you know? Our first power moon. Well, yeah, what a ride. And we made it to Cascade Kingdom. Sorry, still a bit amped for Captain Powerline, but I must collect myself. There should be an old airship somewhere around here. So let's see what we can find if we can find it. Let's see if we can find it. Checkpoint for ourselves, Waterfall Basin. Beautiful little area as well. Again, like, just gorgeous. Like, art style is so much more important than graphics in every single sense. Regardless, like, I, like, I don't care. I don't hear, I don't listen to that debate, by the way. Capture Bert. Like, I just don't. And I know, like, it's, like, kind of, like, I've listened to it for years. To me, like, you know, the, the proof is always in the pudding. What's this? Ooh. The proof is always there. Games like this, this will look good in 20 years' time. I threw a rock at you. Oh, the music as well. It's making me feel so good. Oh. It feels so freaking good, right? Can we do, tr can we triple jump? We can, and we do this to roll. Perfect. Okay, we're learning. Why did they give us this? Just so we can do a shortcut style? No? Yeah, why did they give us this? What does it say? Travel tip, homing cap throw. After throwing your cap, shake the pro controller again to form a homing cap throw. You will cap will fly toward the nearest target. You can see, it's super handy. Oh, let's see, let's like, they like this? Ooh. Like this? Woo! Yay! Oh my god, I'm definitely using Joy-Cons after this, guys. I'm sorry, like, it does not feel right shaking. What do you got? Wait, I'm a- Oh my god, why? This way. Oh. So, I remember very distinctly people going crazy collecting all of these things. Da moons, they're called, aren't they? Like moons? You got a moon, first power moon, yeah. People are going absolutely nuts collecting these and like, wait. Why? Oh, I thought they were taking me out of the level, Super Mario 64 style. Multi-moon atop the fall. Look at that Triceratops. And there's a bunny rabbit up there as well. A beautiful one too, if I ever saw one. The dress is too detailed. We found a power moon. What a lucky break. This will come in handy to the power air of the airship. Have you ever seen anything like it? Let's check down here as well though, because we might have forgot something. Like hidden area. Okay. Not a hidden area. Thank you very much, Chompagoo. Chompigu. Oh my god, look at this. Mario has rain effects on the screen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this looks like one of the, pla the like a house, but it's destroyed. Ah, uh, there it is. This is what we're looking for. It's looking a bit more rough than I expected. I know, it's just an older model. I'm certain it can still fly. Let's give it a shot. Shall we throw me on that globe there? We need five more moons to do this. Yeah, we need five more moons. Oh, what's happening? That power moon is to give the ship enough energy. Wonder if we can find more around here. So we just have to find five moons. That's exactly what I wanted to do anyway, so. I said, what if we found five moons? I love how this game looks. Uh, we're doing a no death run, by the way. We will not die once in this game. If we do die, we go back to the star. Hold on a second. How do we... Is there a spin jump in this game? I wonder. Oh, a little chompy family. We're the chompers. We're going on a family picnic. Man, looking off in the distance as well. Waterfalls have always been like these like mythical things to me. 
Even though I know they're not mythical. You know what I'm saying when I say like they feel like mythical things? Um, because it's like what, how, like, like, I, 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 I'm in this, I, I do, I do, I do support teaching in geography, and like, so I'm seeing all this stuff, and still I'm like, you know, what the hell? You know what I mean? It's like, and I shouldn't be. <laughs> I really shouldn't be, but um, I am. Because it's still amazing. Like, I think, you know, the day we stop being amazed by the wonders of the world is the day that I want to just, like, leave this world. You know what I mean? Like, everything's still so gorgeous. Like, you can stop and take a look at stuff all the time. Even, like, like every day... That's a dinosaur! Come, we, we can become the dinosaur. We can become the dinosaur. The birds are just, like, chilling with him, though, so he's probably a cool dinosaur. He's probably a cool one. Now I am Dinosaur. Who wants it? <laughs> you chomps going on a picnic? Huh, you nerds? Huh? Watch this. Yeah. That's what I thought. I probably need you guys to do something. Not anymore. You don't need this. None of you need this now. I'm a coming. Oh, we have to break down the wall with the dinosaur, I think. Watch this. Wait, and this as well. That's one moon. Now we break down this. Uh, who else wants to die? Did someone else ask for death? You can stay here, dinosaur. Oh, he's so dizzy. I'll be back for you guys in a second. I gotta get this moon. We're doing Naruto run down here. Awesome. You got a moon. Chomps with rocks. We have... We need another... Three. We need another three. Wait, is Dinosaur gone? Is he back up here? I'm back sleeping up here. Don't worry about me. Yeah, I won't worry about you. Don't worry. Thank you. Just trying to live my best life. I know you are. You'd helped us a lot. This is like an Aragorn says, like, now go in peace. <laughs> to the... To the... Whatchamacallit boys. The ghost boys in Return of the King. <laughs> I'm like, hey, these guys are pretty handy in a tight spot, Mario. And Mario's like, nah, we gotta let the dinosaur sleep. You see this? Yeah, a little pattern on the wall there, a little pat urn. There's like Goombas imprinted on the walls as well, which is pretty interesting. We need to get all in a go. Look at this. We need to get all in one go. So what's the best bet to do this? It's probably like this. I totally got that. Okay. What if we do it like this? It's just a homing. Yeah, it's just a homing. Okay, cool. Spin throw. When you're surrounded by enemies and you just wish you could get them all at once, snap the pro controller to the side and do a spin throw that will spin you all around. Wait, like this? Wait, let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it now. I guess. Okay, let's see if it works in a group of enemies. First of all, should we brought Dino to come up here and destroy these? Probably not. Oh, let's destroy these guys first, then we'll go up this way. We can check out the map, which is hilarious. I don't know why. Very funny stuff. Hey boys, how are you? Let's go. There we go. Hey, oh, we're doing a no debt run. So if you could please boys, just be kind about this. We're doing a no death run. Fools thought we weren't doing a no death run. Remember, if we die once in this... Actually, if I die once in this playthrough, we just delete the channel. That's what we're doing here. Such beautiful scenery in this game. Hey, Chompa Doodle Doo. How are you, buddy? Oh! Okay, wind up and release on this... Wait, on this wall over here, right? There's like some 2D stuff here. Really cool to just have this here. Wait, did Mario become 2D too? Did we kill... The chob. Not sure how I feel about that, but look, look, he's dead. They did a really cool thing with this.
Okay, destroy that. Like, this is kind of cute, isn't it? It's kind of cute. Like, I'm never, like, fully on board for this all the time. It's not, like, something I'm, like, nostalgic for, you know what I mean? Because I never played these games as... Oh! Our first death! We have to end the channel. Oh, we got more. Nice. Oh, we can break this open, too. I never played this game, these games as a kid at all. Uh, I didn't know they existed until like a few years afterwards. My first ever exposure to Mario really was like kids in school talking about it. Uh, and then I remember, uh, oh, we have stuff here still left just for you. Let's go. Uh, and then I remember, legit, like, going into a store, and I tell this story a lot because it's actually my, like, it's actually, like, one of my moments where I'm like, oh my god. Uh, I went to a store called Burke's. It's no longer open. It was a, uh, it's just a store, like a news agent, so I don't know what you call that in America, or, like, in other countries. Like a convenience store, I suppose, maybe? Uh, we call them, like, news agents. Because they sold the news uh, papers, and they were agents of news. Uh, but anyway, um, I went into the store and saw this video game magazine. I was going to buy the PlayStation magazine because I was a PlayStation player, and I saw Mario Galaxy on the cover. And I was like, oh my lord. That looks like the craziest darn thing I've ever seen in my life. And I said, mother, what the hell is that? And she said, I have no idea. Stop talking to me about video games. And I'm like, no, no problem, mama. Um, but really, like, I remember just that year buying Mario Kart, was it, for the Wii? Or maybe it was a year after that. I, like, the, this Christmas I got the Wii was a fabulous Christmas. And I say fabulous because, like, it's one of my favorite memories altogether. Um, because at that point in time, you know, I just didn't, you just, there was no care in the world. Like, the, like, there really wasn't. Like, buying... But you know, you know what I mean? I know it sounds weird, but like buying the Wii, the Wii was like the most carefree machine that ever existed. It was literally just about being carefree. It was literally just about like, you do what you want, you play games, have fun with your family, have fun with your friends. Hey, you don't want to have fun with your friends, here's some RPGs that are kind of cool, here's some like games that are really cool. It was really... <laughs> Excuse me. It was really just an era of like great fun for me that like I really enjoyed. And like, here's the thing, like, the, hey, ha 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 ha, you gotta stop that now. I feel good. There you go. Right there. Um, it was just an error that I really loved. Like, and I think, I think a lot of you people would like agree with me as well. We're on top of the Triceratops. What if we get to its bottom, then it's on the Triceratops bottom? We're on the Triceratops then. Is this a boss battle? Lady, are you a boss battle? Because you actually look amazing. A golden chomp? Oh my lord. How are you, lady? What's this? You say you need to repair some silly old airship? Well, I can never power any of my precious power moves. It sounds to me like someone wants to be a snack from our dog, but chain chumpkins. <laughs> Speaking of snacks, you are a snack. Okay, what if I become it? Oh my god! Lady, I felt bad about that. I'm sorry, girl. Oh, how did she do that? She's a genius. I don't think she like resists the pull a bit. Jesus Christ, lady, lady. Even I, even I am against this. Even I think that I've done wrong. Don't worry, I'm not gonna excuse my actions. Lady. 
Oh my god, I love how she like tries to grab you back and if you don't move away she will like and it's just try to pull on it then. Like this. Really fun boss battle. Unbelievable design. The Brutals are awesome. And that will give us three power moons, I suppose, and not around that around her neck. Really awesome level. Like this is ha this is a fantastic way to start this game. I'm just having a great, great amount of time. You've done it, and now we got a multi moon. Oh, it's the strongest three power moons combined, it should get the ship moving in no time. Let's see if you can make this work. Throw me on that globe. Let's see. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, I was wondering. I was worried that we weren't going to find the other three. Or she was only going to have one. I was very worried for a second. But look, there's no point worrying. The Odyssey is now restored, because that's where they get the Odyssey. Or the name of the Odyssey. We've enough to fuel to reach the Sand Kingdom. Let's go save those Oculus. Yeah, I'll do whatever you want. I'll do whatever you want. I gotta see something first of all. I should update this the console. Why don't you take the helm? Just select the sign and press A and we'll be off. I need to see something. Okay, so if we do this, it it doesn't move the game. What I love. Yes, beautiful, beautiful. Guys, that's probably gonna do for this episode of Super Mario Odyssey, my first ever playthrough of Super Mario Odyssey. Having the best time. Having the absolute best time with this game. Um enjoying myself to like the absolute max uh i really think that this is like going to be an, a really fun playthrough for me i really do um thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys for always watching thank you guys for being so supportive and i'll see you guys very very soon bye bye